Hello everyone, thank you for clicking onto my short 5-10 to 10 minute video. My name is Joshua Haith and I am a 15 year old artist from Nottinghamshire. Um, I was invited by the Positively Empowered Kids team, Claire more specifically, to share my story of where I was, where I am and most importantly where I am going. So as I said, I am an artist and these are some of my pieces that I have got behind me which I will talk you through. So I have my painting of Lady Gaga from the Born This Way album, my painting of Ariana Grande, well one of them anyway. I am very excited for positions to come out very soon. Um, I have my painting I've done of the Titanic. So I have the Titanic boat, Celine Dion, Kate Winslet and Leonardo DiCaprio and I have a few of my Tudor portraits. The Tudors seem to be my most popular ones, especially in the US, but I have two here of Anne Boleyn, she is the second wife of Henry VIII and the mother to Queen Elizabeth I and then I have Mary I, who is the daughter of Catherine of Aragon and Henry VIII and who reigned just before Elizabeth, she is also known as Bloody Mary from the executions that she took out on Protestants. But this is not a history lesson, don't worry, I'm not going to be teaching history but I just wanted to go through all the different portraits that I have behind me. So I started to do my artwork and sell um, when I was about 13. It was just before my 14th birthday. And I did a painting of Ariana Grande. Not this one that I've got behind me, but it was exactly the same image, just not that same portrait. And I got orders from my friends, my dad's friends, my mum's friends, and I never really charged. Um, I probably charged the canvas cost and a little bit extra for my time but I never really developed a price but I did many different ones. I did James Charles, Jeffree Star, Singers, Christina Aguilera, Amy Winehouse. So from that point I have developed my size range and my price range. So that is all organised now, no need to worry. Um, before I started to sell my artwork, I have been home educated the majority of my life. I did go into school for a short period of time. As you can probably tell by my facial expression, it was not the best time of my life. I did come away from um, primary with many self-confidence issues, image issues, um, from fellow students, um, which is probably something many people can relate to, but my one piece of advice regarding that is they've got no problems with you. It's all a self-reflection on them, which obviously I never realised at the time, but when, when you're out of the situation and you can look in, that is what you do realise, that it was all down to them, all their issues, everything that they said, everything that they did was a reflection of their own issues, which is it never really helps you know overcoming your brain what happened but it does give you a sense of clarity and a sense of moving forward and that you can regain your confidence and that you can go on and progress and make amazing things happen so that's just a little bit of a background i am in nottingham college currently which may surprise you you're 15 but I'm on a pre-16 GCSE course. I've been doing that for three years now. I'm on my third year now. I have sat, well I didn't sit obviously with COVID, but I have three GCSEs and I am doing two more now. Psychology and Religious Studies. So that is my education and now I'm on to my paintings. So I had those few commissions to start off with and I thought, hang on, people actually like these. So I went on to Instagram in the hope of having maybe canvases and orders from people that I did not know, which I did. I had my Tudors blow up and sell all over the place, especially in the US, as I said, but I also had other countries such as Spain. I am going into Australia, Africa, the Netherlands, Russia, so many different countries right now, which is very strange, um, but that's where I started with the American I have done many, many different portraits. These are only just a few that I have got in the house um, because most of the ones that I do are commissioned based. So I don't paint them and then sell them. But I have painted for 
a few different famous people in the past. I have painted for TV historian and author Dan Jones. He does many, many different documentaries and presents them on Channel 5. Um, I haven't revealed these yet, but I am painting for the biggest reality star in the UK, I can probably safely say, Gemma Collins. I am so excited. I'm trying to calm myself down a bit, but it's going to be full pink, full glitz, full glam for the biggest diva in the UK. I am so excited to do that picture. I am also painting for a rock band called Within Temptation, who are having their tour next year with one of the biggest rock bands in history, Evanescence. So I'm really excited to do those two. One is obviously going to the UK and one is going off to the Netherlands, which is my first Netherlands picture. So that is something that's coming up very, very soon. I have revealed Within Temptation. I have not revealed Gemma Collins yet, but by the time this video comes out, I will have. So a little bit of a spoiler for Claire when she gets this. Um, I have been producing Tudor calendars for the past, over the past month now, and they are being printed as I do this video, hopefully on sale next week. They have already been booked out, so hopefully I will need to increase my quantity even more. I've already done it once, so I have all my envelopes here, padded ones for America, paper ones for UK. Um, that's only a few of them that I have got. I have a whole new pile over there, but I can't lift them all in one go. I find it really difficult, so I've left those over there. So we have many, many things that are coming. They are really, really exciting. I am painting for one more celebrity, and I am doing a few next year for a few models, but I am not going to reveal those yet I will keep those as a surprise. I am having my prints done um, very soon of all my different pictures, unless they are commission based I will leave those out, but all the ones that I have got here will all be printed and on sale. So many, many exciting things are happening for you if you are running, if you are around my age or maybe even older uh, or even younger and you're running your own business, my advice to you would be get a plan. Really just organise yourself, get a plan, work. I mean, I believe in manifestation. You know, there's no doubt in my brain that it does not exist. But, for example, if you want to learn how to play the piano, watching Netflix is not going to teach you how to play the piano. You've got to sit there and you've got to work and you've got to learn how all the different keys work, all the different tunes they make, you have got to work and learn how to do it. So have your plan, any opportunities that come up, don't be just straight vision, allow to go off the path a tiny bit so you can get as much opportunities, as much experience as you possibly can. Organise yourself so you can make a sort like with me, I've organised my calendars, I've organised my canvas brightness, my sizes, it's over a gradual time, you can't expect all of it to be done in one go. You've got to have your experiences, your... Oh, I shouldn't have done that, I should have done this better, I should have done all this. You will have your experiences as you go along. And also going back to the school experiences, believe in yourself that you can do it. Because I don't even know you. I'm doing this video and I don't know who is watching, but I believe that if you work and you believe in yourself, you can do whatever you want to do. As I am starting to do with my pictures, I mean, I am only two years in and I am painting for celebrities, Netflix stars, all sorts, so they are not being revealed yet. I did give, give a little bit of a hint there. But that's really all I can say. So thank you so much for watching this nine minute video. I will wrap up now. Um, if you wish to follow me on social media to see a few more of my paintings, my name is Joshua Haith. It's exactly the same for Instagram and Facebook. You can go on my pages on both social media accounts. So again, thank you to the Positively Empowered Kids team for inviting me to do this video. I hope you all enjoyed whether you've got some inspiration, some information, anything out of this video, I hope it has done you a service. Thank you for